Class 3.9 Bank Reconciliation To do Bank Reconciliation, we need to go to GL and then choose Bank Reconciliation In this Bank Reconciliation, you may need to choose which bank that you are you prefer to do the Bank Recon So for example, we will do CIMB Bank So what we need to do is to highlight the CIMB Bank and then you have to click on the new button so here you need to fill in the bank statement date as per your original bank statement so the bank statement date is on 30th of april and after that you just click ok so basically this is the bank reconciliation wizard so in here you can see the bank account number already stated for you and what is the bank the bank statement date and in this uh, bank reconciliation it will show the transaction cleared at the other date as well but the date range that will be appear is only from 1st of April until 30th of April so the first step is to do bank reconciliation the first step is to go to the actual bank statement balance on your right side you can see the actual bank statement balance here is zero in the beginning so what you need to do here is you need to key in your actual bank statement balance as per your original bank statement which is 107500 so we key in 107500 so after we key in this actual bank statement balance when I click at the any empty space you can see there is a difference of 5500 so to make it the bank reconciliation balance what you need to do the difference here must be zero so to reduce the difference of this bank reconciliation what you need to do is you need to compare all the transaction that you have with the statement with the bank statement that you receive in the uh, sorry with the bank statement that you receive in your hand so for example we already provide you with the bank statement in the cost book there so it, see, it seems that on 15 on April, we have the debit side 2000 and description is 333001. So here we need to compare with our system. When in the bank statement 2000 debit side, so in our system, the amount will be on credit side. So do we have credit side 2033001 if have what you need to do is to tick at the box there after you tick you proceed to the next transaction which is HSBC 11122 2005 credit side so if credit side in our bank statement it will be debit side in our system so what we need to do do we have HSBC 112 2005 if yes, we need to tick. And the next one is HLB 333 444 6000 credit side. Do we have debit side 6000? HLB 3344. If yes, we click yes. And the last one is 333003 debit side 1000. So in our system will be credit side. So 333003 credit side 1000 and then we after we done comparing between both system and also our state bank statement, you can see the difference has become zero. So to save your bank reconciliation, what you need to do is to click OK. And you can see the status will appear as a bank reconciliation balance. So to print out this bank reconciliation, what you can do is to just click at the bank reconciliation here and you can just click on preview and you can choose which report that we you, you sorry you wish to print out is either bank reconciliation report or bank reconcile transaction report after you then print you can just click cancel and then you can just close from your bank reconciliation <music>